A blessed day everyone, it's me again, Teacher Lumaban, and if you are new in my channel, don't forget to subscribe, and hit the notification bell, to be updated in my videos. This time we will discuss Chapter 13, Insurance Cooperative of the Republic Act No. 9520, also known as an act amending the Cooperative Code of the Philippines, to be known as the Philippine Cooperative Code of 2008. Commit your way to the Lord, trust also in Him, and He shall bring it to pass. Psalm 37 verse 5 Republic of the Philippines Congress of the Philippines Metro Manila 14th Congress Second Regular Session Begun and held in Metro Manila, on Monday, the 28th day of July, 2008 Republic Act No. 9520 an act amending the Cooperative Code of the Philippines to be known as the Philippine Cooperative Code of 2008. Be it enacted by the Senate and House of Representatives of the Philippines in Congress assembled. Section 13. Articles 99, 100, 101, 102, 103, 104, 105, 106, 107, 108 and 109 of Chapter 13 on special provisions relating to cooperative banks of the same code are hereby transferred to another chapter. Chapter 13 as amended shall now read, as follows. Chapter 13. Insurance Cooperative. Article. 105. Cooperative Insurance Societies. Existing cooperatives may organize themselves into a cooperative insurance entity for the purpose of engaging in the business of insuring life and property of cooperatives and their members. Article 106 Types of insurance provided Under the cooperative insurance program established and formed by the virtue of the provisions of this code, the cooperative insurance societies shall provide its constituting members different types of insurance coverage consisting of, but not limited to, life insurance with special group coverage, loan protection, retirement plans, endowment, motor vehicle coverage, bonding, crop and livestock protection and equipment insurance. Article 107 Applicability of Insurance Laws the provisions of the insurance code and all other laws and regulations relative to the organization and operation of an insurance company shall apply to cooperative insurance entities organized under this code. The requirements on capitalization, investments, and reserves of insurance firms may be liberally modified upon consultation with the authority and the cooperative sector, but in no case may be requirement to be reduced to less than half of those provided for under the insurance code and other related laws. Article 108. Implementing Rules The Insurance Commission and the Authority, in consultation with the concerned cooperative sector, shall issue the appropriate rules and regulations implementing the provisions of this chapter. I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. I hope you learned something on our topic about Chapter 13, Insurance Cooperative of the Republic Act No. 9520, also known as an Act Amending the Cooperative Code of the Philippines, to be known as the Philippine Cooperative Code of 2008. If you learned something in this video, Please give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to share this video with your friends to also learn about this topic. If you have comments, questions, and suggestions, you can leave a message in the comment section below. Thank you very much for watching my videos. 
hoping that we meet again in my next blog, and God bless you always.